Welcome to the short demo on how you can use Basumo to track your competitor's content and how well it's performing across social networks. With Basumo, it's a relatively straightforward process. We just type in the domain name of the competitor we're interested in. Let's say, for example, I'm interested in moz.com and I hit search. What Basumo brings back for me instantly is the most shared content that links to moz.com over the last six months. And I can filter this by time period uh, on the left hand side here. So I could be interested in just the past week or past month, for example. So it immediately gives me a, a view on how well the content's being shared, which is quite extensively. So 10,000 shares for the cheat sheet here, um, most of which actually took place on Google Plus. Um, and then on Twitter uh, in terms of the networks. Um, I can also see what type of content's working for them. It does appear to be that the, the most shared was the cheat sheet. Third here is the free SEO tools. Fourth one here is a free visual guide. So practical resources seem to be working quite well for Moz at the current time. But I could also filter this if I was interested in what are they doing around infographics. I can remove uh, the other Type, content types here and just look for infographics. So I can see they are using infographics um, and how often that's being shared and across which networks. And again, fairly broadly spread uh, across uh, the networks. What's also interesting is I mean, if I go down, let's say I want to go back to articles first. So I want to see a lot more content. I want to see the content in the last week so what's been shared in the last week? So this particular top article shared 1800 times. Um, interesting, when I go down to the second article there, I can see that's been shared 800 times or almost 900 times on Twitter, but not at all on Google+. Plus. Um, if I want to, and it's a useful article, I can share it directly on Google+, Plus or, or via Buffer, uh, direct from within Buzzsumo. What I can also do here is see what that's shared 1800 times. Let's have a look at who shared it. So I can view the sharers who may have been influential in amplifying that content. So I can sort these in a number of ways. It's currently sorted by relevancy, but if I click here on followers, I can resort by the people who have the most reach in terms of the numbers of followers. So obviously Moz themselves, but Gerardo uh, here has got 600,000 followers, David Papp, 200,000 followers these people will have extended the reach of that content clearly by retweeting it. But I could also sort by page authority, by page rank, um, or by the retweet ratio, so who's more likely to retweet uh, content. So hopefully you can see how I can start to look at who shared content uh, and possibly try to work out why they were sharing the content and then people that I might want to engage to share my own content. I can also see the type of content that Moz is sharing, the networks that they're uh, exploiting to, to get that traction. So, and I can also look at things like headlines and analyze the headlines and types uh, there. So hopefully that's given you a quick overview as to how you can look at what your competitors might be doing in terms of their content, what traction it's getting, uh, and across what networks that's working for them.